Today we're going to conduct an investigation to see which objects reflect light. Now to do this investigation we need to understand that light travels in straight lines. Have a look at this picture. The sun is a light source in this picture and you can see the sun's rays streaming through the clouds in a straight line. Light travels in straight lines until something stops it. Now, this means that light bounces off the object and the light does not go through it. In our investigation today, we are going to use a torch as our light source and we are going to see which of these objects stop the light from passing through it. The objects that we will be testing include tissue paper, foil, book, a plastic bag, and a glass of water. Before we test each object, we are going to make a prediction. Do you know what the word prediction means? It means to have a really good guess. So I want you to have a really good guess. Do you think that the book will reflect the light? That means it will stop the light from passing through it. Or do you think that the light will pass through it? What's your prediction? I'm going to put the book in front of the torch. Have a look to see what happens. Does the light pass through it? Or does the book stop the light from passing through? You can see in the background that the wall goes dark. This means that this book reflects the light. Now let's make another prediction. Do you think that the plastic bag will reflect the light? That means it will stop the light from passing through or will the light pass through it? Have a think about your prediction and then we'll have a look to see what happens. I'm putting the bag in front of the light. As you can see, the wall is still bright with light. This means that this bag does not reflect the light. It lets it pass through it. Now I want you to make a prediction about the foil. Will the foil reflect the light? That means will it stop the light from passing through it or will the light pass through it? Have a think about your prediction and then we'll have a look to see what happens. I'm going to put the foil in front of our source of light which is the torch. Have a look to see what happens. Do you think that the foil reflects the light? which means stops it from passing through, or do you think that the light goes through? Now I would like you to make a prediction about the tissue paper. Do you think that the tissue paper will reflect the light, or will the light pass through it? What's your prediction? I'm going to put the tissue paper in front of the light source. Have a look to see what happens in the background. The wall turns red. That means that the light does pass through this tissue paper. The tissue paper does not reflect the light. I've got one last prediction for you to make. Do you think that the glass of water will reflect the light? Or will the light pass through the water? Let's have a look. What do you think? Do you think that the glass of water reflects the light or lets the light pass through it? Thank you for taking the time to watch this. I hope that you really enjoyed it and that you learned a lot about light and how it reflects off objects. What I would like you to do now is use the information that you have learnt to complete the slides for this week.